Hard water contains higher levels of minerals, such as calcium and magnesium, while soft water has a lower mineral content. These minerals can have a significant impact on the flavor of your tea. Fun fact. Did you know that the term hard water comes from the difficulty it can cause when trying to lather soap? The higher mineral content in hard water can accentuate the boldness of black teas, like Assam or English breakfast. It can enhance their body and bring out their natural sweetness. Soft water, however, with its lower mineral content, is the go-to choice for delicate teas such as green and white teas. It allows their nuanced flavors to shine without interference. Now let's look at brewing tea with hard water versus soft water, and the choice between hard and soft water can significantly impact the taste of your tea. Fun fact. The mineral content in water can affect the color of your tea. Hard water can make your tea appear darker. To mitigate the potential chalky or metallic taste of hard water, consider using a water filter or softener. This can help strike a balance between enhancing the tea's flavors and avoiding undesirable mineral notes. Soft water, in contrast, can sometimes make tea taste flat. If that happens, try adding a pinch of salt to your brewing water. The small amount of minerals from the salt can add complexity and depth. Next, let's move on to water filters and softeners. They can be a real game changer for your tea. Fun fact. Ancient Romans were known to use water softening techniques, like adding plant ashes, to improve the taste of their water. When choosing a water filter or softener, consider one that specifically targets the minerals in hard water. This will ensure that you retain the water's purity while reducing mineral content. But if you're on a budget or have limited space, using bottled spring water is an excellent alternative. Many brands offer water naturally balanced for brewing tea. Now, what can you do if your tea doesn't taste quite right with your tap water? Let's explore some solutions. Fun fact. In some regions, the water's mineral content is so distinct that it has led to unique regional tea flavors. If you've tried adjusting your water source and still aren't satisfied, experiment with steeping times and temperatures. These variables can compensate for the characteristics of your water. And don't hesitate to ask local tea experts or tea shops for advice. They may have insights specific to your region's water quality. Next we'll look at more specific teas and water types, and it is a fact that certain teas do harmonize better with different types of water. Fun fact, in China, different types of water have been matched with specific teas for centuries, enhancing the overall tea experience. Black teas flourish in hard water, balancing astringency with natural sweetness. This makes them perfect for pairing with hard water. Green and white teas thrive in soft water, preserving their delicate and nuanced flavors. Soft water lets the subtleties shine through. Herbal teas are more versatile and forgiving, and they work well with both hard and soft water, making them a great choice for experimentation. And there you have it, tea aficionados, the impact of your tap water on your tea's taste, and how to make the most of it. If you found this video enlightening, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and like, share and subscribe to 5 o'clock tea for more tea related insights. If you have any questions or want to share your own water and tea experiences, please leave a comment below. Until next time, may your tea always be brewed to perfection, no matter your water source.